Today I'm decorating for summer and I am really excited for summer. While I'm filming this, I have two days left to school. When you're watching this, I will officially be a teacher on a summer break, so I am so excited. And since I'll be home a lot more, I wanted to give our home a little refresh for summer and redecorate, just add a couple of touches here and there. I'm gonna keep things really simple, add some fresh flowers, of course, and give a refresh to our bedroom as well. So I hope that you find some summer decorating ideas and enjoy. This is most of the decor that I'm going to be using. It's lots of neutrals, but I'll also be adding some fresh flowers and greenery that I think will add a really pretty pop of color. Before I start decorating, I'm going to make a quick little refreshing summer drink. I've been obsessed with drinking these in the afternoon, so I'm going to quickly get some ice. And how cute is this cup? It's from Disney. It says Midnight Curfew. It's a little Cinderella slipper. It's super cute. And then I just take this Spindrift um, sparkling water. It's so good. This is the strawberry lemonade flavor. And it doesn't have sugar or anything, it's unsweetened. It's just really refreshing, I love sparkling water. And I add a splash of the Costco lemonade. So yummy. And then I'm just gonna cut a strawberry and then some lemon. I'm gonna add the strawberries. Um, lemon just like two little slices in there this would be a good cocktail too if you add like some vodka if you like anything like that but this is just super good and refreshing and perfect for summer so cheers I'm gonna get to decorating now Starting on our entryway, I got this planter from Anthropology a while ago, but I just hadn't used it. But I think it looks really pretty here on the entryway table. And then just adding some stems to it from Target and this lantern candle holder with a battery operated candle. And I think it looks really pretty and summery. And then a candle and just using that stone tray to anchor it. I had a basket with flowers on that decorative ladder and I decided to just take it off and just leave it a little bit more simple. I love just simplifying my decor for the summer. I think it looks just more fresh and light and airy which is a vibe I really like during the spring and summer. Before I do more decorating downstairs, I'm also going to be doing a little bit of a summer refresh upstairs here in our master bedroom. I'm really excited to be working with Brooklinen. They are sponsoring this portion of today's video. 
And right now, Brooklinen is having their Memorial Day sale until June 1st. You can use my link below to get 15% off your entire purchase because high quality sheets are really expensive, but Brooklinen gives you that luxury quality and comfort for an affordable price by cutting out the middleman. And not only do they feel amazing, but they look great too. They really do have that beautiful, luxurious look without the luxury markup. Brooklinen sheets have more than 90,000 five-star reviews. That's more than any other online bedding company. And you can mix and match over 20 colors and patterns to fit your style and look of your bedroom. You can get the classic or luxe hardcore bundle. So I got the classic hardcore bundle, which is a cool and crisp, breathable 270 thread count weave. It has that soft, timeless, hotel style luxury, and it's just perfect for hot sleepers, and you will just be cool all night long. And with this Texas heat, if you live in Texas, you know you need that. So I think these are just perfect for the summer. And instead of buying the individual items, you can save 25% by purchasing the Hardcore Bundle, which includes a core sheet set, extra pillowcase, and a duvet cover. And it is just super easy to put your bundle together, choosing whatever color or patterns you like. I love the white duvet cover I got. It really looks and feels like a cloud. This past week of sleeping with our Brooklinen bedding has just been so comfy and it's just a really good refresh to our summer bedroom. Now I'm going to add some summer decor to our kitchen and first I'm going to make some fresh flower arrangements for our kitchen island and dining table. I got some fresh flowers from Trader Joe's and I really love the peonies that I got and when I bought them they were completely closed which I thought was great so they can last me a little bit longer but for some reason when I took them out of the plastic they completely opened up and then they started to just lose their color pretty quickly like within a few days so I don't know why that happened I feel like that really hasn't happened before that quickly at least but I still love the way that they look and they're just really beautiful and I think they kind of remind me like of Hawaii so the flower arrangements I think look really pretty for the summer. From Mrs. Myers smells so good. If you find it, get it. Close your eyes. I took everything off the countertops and island and just wiping it down so I can start with a clean slate. I'm gonna add some decor and try to keep things pretty simple. I got this cookbook holder from McGee & Co and I really love the vintage look that it has and just bringing those wood elements into the kitchen I feel like really warms up the space and then I got this new cookbook called Sunday Suppers and I think it is just so pretty and it really just matches the aesthetic of my kitchen. The world could fall down, it's gonna be okay. I'm gonna add a pop of color to this space. 
I love the pattern on these serving spoons. I got them from Home Goods a couple of years ago. And then this mini planter is from Target last year. And I love a little bit of color here. It gives it more of a summer vibe. And then on this corner, I'm adding this picture with these dried florals that I use for my spring decor. But I really loved it, so I wanted to incorporate it to my summer decor. And then just adding some biscotti to this glass canister. I really like using a variation of materials in my decor and since I have a lot of wood going on in the kitchen, I added that marble fruit bowl just to mix things up a little bit and then I had some fresh flowers left over that I added to this space. For the island, I'm adding the other fresh flower arrangement that I made and using this brass tray to anchor my decor. Of course, lemons are a staple for summer decor and since I use them so much, having fresh lemons is just perfect here. I would wait a lifetime if you were at sea I just wanna say that I feel that our love is real Okay guys, I think I went a little pillow crazy. I usually just get pillow covers or don't get pillows at all, but I really felt like I needed some color. And I really like these blue tones and just the different textures and patterns. The ones I had just were kind of blending with the couch since they were cream as well. So I'm excited for these and I think that they're going to look really pretty for the summer. For the side table, I'm using these palm leaves in this vase, which I think are perfect for summer decor. And then again, using a variation of materials with a wooden riser. Make our love a story that would never end. Never thought I'd feel so alive. Looking in your eyes, I just wanna love you till the day. Something that I did for this summer decor and I do pretty often is just moving around decor pieces that I already have so not having to buy so many new things each season. I had this up for the spring in my entryway table so just moved it here and this candle I've had for a while so all of this still looks really pretty for the summer. And here's a little hack for greenery. I bought this fresh greenery from Trader Joe's a while ago and I just let it dry out and then I sprayed it with some hairspray and it dries really pretty. It looks like I bought it this way and it's really affordable and easy to do. And moving on to the coffee table, so I splurged on this Architectural Digest book. I've been wanting it for a while and 
It's pretty pricey, but it was on sale on the TJ Maxx's website, and I love looking through decor books and decorating with them. So I just went for it, and I love how it looks here. And then just adding this wooden bowl that I got from Amazon, which is also a very recent favorite find. It's rare. Like I said, I'm moving around decor that I already had, so just adding some extra decor to this hutch where it was missing some pieces that I'm using somewhere else. I'm adding the other fresh flower arrangement to the dining table and using this linen tray to set them on. Hope you guys got some summer decorating ideas and enjoyed i would love for you to subscribe for more don't forget brooklinen is having their memorial day sale until june 1st you can use my link down below to get 15 percent off your entire purchase they have really been so comfortable i cannot recommend them enough and batman agrees thanks so much for watching and i'll see you on my next one